I don't do anything very much. It's just the people who make the calls. They do the running, they do the counting, they help make the kills, they put together um, social media things. I found, I got a message from next door. Do you know, <laughs> I put a message out there about needing help. 1,000, 1 thousand people viewed it. I hope that that's a good thing. So I wanted to introduce you to a family that have been good supporters of the Salvation Army. And this is the Wyckoff family, and I got permission to talk about them. Um, many years ago, Mr. Wyckoff was living in a, another state, and his company used to support the Salvation Army and get out the employees to ring bells. So when he moved here to Texas, um, they started this tradition also. Well, unfortunately, they lost their darling sister, Casey, and that was to a drunk driver. So for the last 10 years, this family, when they come into town, they go out and they t they've been taking four stores, have to have their own kettle, and they have fierce competition. And um, they ring bells and um, support um, you know, her memory. And the bracelet that I wear says her name, and it says, life's a gift, pay it forward. And I think that's what we've all been doing with what we do with the bell ringing and the angel tree and all the rest of it. So the, the reading I, want, I chose from Deuteronomy 31 verse 8 today was, The Lord himself goes before you and will be with you. He will never leave you nor forsake him. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. He was with us. Did you notice the weather? It has been lovely. I mean, it's a little chilly, but it certainly wasn't in the freezing. So thank you, God, for that. And of course, we didn't have a lot of rainy days that kept people in their houses. The last few days it rained, but you know, people are forced to get out because they haven't shopped. <laughs> so we're very, we're very thankful for that. So, Ashes, would you come forward, please?